What is medical marijuana? Medical marijuana is the smokable form of dried and shredded parts of the cannabis plant, including flowers, seeds, leaves, and stems. These four components contribute to the many names for these parts and how they can be used. When you inhale marijuana, it is quickly released into the bloodstream and makes its way to the brain and other organs. For example, when you smoke marijuana, it goes straight to your brain, then to your heart, and then to your organs, creating in a high that comes about quickly and efficiently. There are other ways to consume marijuana other than smoking. Many people now like to use edibles, which are forms of marijuana that you can eat or drink. These can come in food, drinks, oils, or tinctures. If you eat marijuana, it is, has to be consumed through the stomach, so it takes a little bit longer for it to be absorbed into the body, but it generally creates a more intense high or a high that lasts longer. But what really are the effects of marijuana? There are many good and bad things about marijuana. Bad things include marijuana can impair your judgment, cause memory problems, Create red eyes, accelerate your heartbeat, and slow your reaction time. Although there are a couple bad things that marijuana can do, there are so many other things that are beneficial about using the plant, such as an increased dopamine level, which is the hormone in your body that allows you to feel happiness, reduced anxiety, relief from glaucoma symptoms, the munchies or the increased des desire to eat, decreased depression symptoms, and decreased risk of tumor growth. All of these benefits of med ma medical marijuana lead to the pros and cons. So the pros and cons of medical marijuana are as follows. The CB1 receptor in the brain accepts the THC form of medical marijuana, but not the CBD form. THC provides a euphoric effect, whereas CBD does not. THC comes in the forms of flour, oil, tinctures, and capsules. CBD comes in the form of gels, gummies, oils, and supplements. Both of these kinds of marijuana are different, but very much the same. However, THC helps to reduce pain, muscle spasms, glaucoma, insomnia, low appetite, nausea, and anxiety. CBD, however, helps to reduce seizures, inflammation, pain, psychosis, irritable, irritable bowel syndrome, nausea, migraines, depression, and anxiety. Nausea and anxiety are helped by both THC and CBD, and you cannot overdose on either. THC and CBD are two different types of the marijuana plant, but they have the same chemical structure. C 
21, age 30, O2. Both provide many of the same medical benefits. Now, if you're wondering what THC is, it's the cannabinoids on the plant. CBD is the synthesized version. High THC usage can lead to long-term psychiatric effects and has some risks associated with it. However, the use of both types of marijuana have been proven to help people with many different ailments. The main takeaways that I would like to provide from this video are that number one, marijuana is a very interesting medicine and there are many more discoveries on the way. Marijuana has provided so much relief for people with pain and should be used as a medicine, not an illegal substance. Number two, there are many different types of marijuana, THC, CBD, and from THC there's indica and sativa. Indica is more of a depressant feeling and sativa is more of a stimulant. Number three, marijuana helps people with many different ailments. Lastly, thank you for watching and if you would like more information, please visit healthline.com, health.harvard.edu, drugabuse.gov, and medicalnewstoday.com. Thank you for watching, and I hope this video provided lots of information on medical marijuana.